hey it's the empire don't forget to hit the like button the subscribe button and the bell icon for more videos be taking over let's go champ hit that like button hit that subscribe button right now let's go hey it's the empire geobasic empire backs for boxing now nah, man chris eubank senior man he's back at it again talking about george groves man and um <laughs> i will read this tweet from you guys right chris eubank senior and i quote me trying to be protective of George Groves gets me negative feedback. I'm not looking to be liked by pretending Watson and Blackwell didn't happen. There's no disgrace in me reminding to the refs to be mindful, as it's genuine. To look at Chris Eubank Jr. seems normal, but he's far from it. There you guys go, man. Chris Eubank Sr., man, basically telling the refs, listen, my son already destroyed Blackwell, you know, and he already destroyed Watson. You know, I don't want any more people to get injured. I don't want any more lives to be lost by this boxing game. Protect George Groves. Yeah. <laughs> Chris Ray Sr., man, spitting that advice to the ref. You know, that, that, you know, he also said, you know, my, my son seems like a normal kid, man, but he's really not, man. He's been trained by by Warrior. You know what I mean? Um, Chris Eubank Sr. is always talking about the Warrior's code. And he's always talking boxing. He's like, you can't play boxing. He says that a lot. He says boxing is, is a way, it's a lifestyle. You can't play boxing. It's it's dangerous, you know? And Chris Eubank Sr. is right, man. And um, Chris Eubank Sr., man, he's, he's oh, he look back in his career, man. He's been through wars. He's lost some. He's won some. So he's completely aware of the of the of the threats boxing faces. You know, um, it's a really dangerous sport. And that being said, man, he raised his son to be ruthless because he doesn't want his son going through the same thing. And um, Chris Eubank Jr., man, let's be honest, man, he's a monster. He's a monster. He's coming to knock you out. He's coming to overwhelm you. He's coming to to style on you. I mean, he when when Chris Eubank Jr. beats you, it's not just a boxing match. I mean, he's putting on a show most of the time. You know, he's putting on a show most of the time. He's not playing with you. And it, 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 it's just a show. It's not even. It's not even like a comedy show. It's like ruthless. The guy will be beating you, and then he'll pause and look at you in your eyes, and then he'll start beating you some more. Then he might look to the crowd, and then he. He might talk to someone and then hit you with the left hook. I mean, that, that's what he did when he fought Blackwell. Talking to Tyson Fury and Billy Joe Saunders and, and start just completely destroying the guy. And um, Groves, man. I mean, you guys see what happened to Yaldemir when he fought that undefeated guy in his country, man, in the tournament. Now, that was complete destruction. It wasn't even close. And, and it didn't look like he was trying all the way. It looked like he was toying with him, you know? So Chris Eubank Sr. is trying to trying to save George Groves, you know. Um, but I mean, flip side to that, because I like to try to bring the other side to it is, it started demeaning to George Groves. I mean, the guy has fought in some elite level fighters. He just knocked out his last opponent. Uh, he's fought in people like Nathan Cleverly, Carl Fresh, you know, the big name fighters. You know, James DeGale. You know, he's fought in some elite fighters. So maybe maybe if Chris Eubank Jr. He can be all that, but he needs to he needs to actually prove in the ring. You know, um this is boxing, man. It's 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 a risk reward resport, you know. I'm pretty sure George Gross is getting compensated. And um I mean let's be honest, George Gross he he you know, yeah, he, he he's been hurt before. He's been knocked out before. So I mean, I'm pretty sure he's not gonna just be getting hit a lot. I'm pretty sure if he gets hit the right way and on the right spot. Off a counter shot, he'd be out. You know what I mean? That's the saying if he wins. But George Groves has the same amount of power, too. This fight can go either way, man. They both have power. But this would be a really good fight. So I'm really excited to see how this fight unfolds. But it's just a little advice from Chrissy Banks Sr., man. You know, protect your fighters. Because, I mean, sometimes um, it's weird, man. Sometimes I'll be watching fights in the UK. And sometimes the ref will give one fighter. I don't know. For some, for some reason, sometimes they'll let it go on too long. You know, there's some fights, don't get me wrong, there's some fights in the UK where the ref will stop it too early, but 
if if this one guy is a favorite and, and the the people like him, they'll just let one guy get beat a little bit too long, you know. Um, the Blackwell fight, for example, guy was getting beat too long before he hopped in, you know. And um, I don't know, man. Um, I guess it could be the style of there in Britain, but the but the European fighters, man, they they fight sort of like Mexicans, man. You got they come forward, they're really aggressive, and there's not much. Just not much. It's just it's just like a warrior type fighting style. Come forward, guns blazing, getting hit in the face. You know what I mean? Toe to toe fighting. You know that that's how the British people fight, in my opinion. Uh, the European ones, at least. So I mean that that's the style over there. So that could just be the style of the region um, to to come forward. You know, um, when I think of you know the hallmark of European style, at least at least. Me personally, I mean, I think of someone like a Carl Frotch, someone who can come forward and take shots and has like a really granite chin, but a like a rugged style. That's like it's been glorified over there in the UK. You know, I watch you fight in the UK and they talk about how like one guy could be getting destroyed. They talk about how he's a warrior and how he's just eating the punches, how they don't face him. But in reality, he's actually getting destroyed and the guy is just getting out of box completely really bad and he can't cut the ring off and he, he's just getting hit a lot. But they talk about how tough he is and how he's a warrior. But but in reality, you, they shouldn't be saying that. They should say this guy's getting destroyed and he needs to defend himself. So, so I mean, sometimes there's bias when they want to implement, you know, a guy getting destroyed or a guy actually using his boxing skills and beating another guy. So I mean, there, there's definitely a bias in the UK, in my opinion, on on which styles they want to uh, talk about the, the the positive side of the style of actually boxing. Or actually taking punches. I mean, it's always a back and forth in the UK. It matters who's fighting, you know. It matters who's the overdog and who's the underdog, or who the crowd really wants to win. So I think Chris Banks Senior, in knowing George Groves, George Groves has a huge fan base. I think George Groves, if he was there in there eating the hits of Chris Banks Junior, if he if he was getting destroyed, let's just say he was getting destroyed, the ref might let it continue, man. They might let's say he's a warrior and he's taking these hits and they don't hurt, but in reality, he could be, he could he could, he could be getting destroyed. I'm I'm just making um one of many situations that can possibly happen. I mean, Chris Eubank could possibly get hurt and stopped. Who knows? But I'm just letting you guys know that this is a reality in the UK. So, man, Chris Eubank is trying to trying to save George Groves. The man of many words, you know what I mean? Let me know how you guys feel about it. Let me know how you guys feel about Chris Eubank Sr.'s uh, advice. You guys think Junior will destroy Groves and he needs to be watched because Groves might just take a little bit too many punches, you know. Let me know how you guys feel about it. I know how I feel about it. Like, comment, subscribe. This is the Empire. Geobasic Empire. Peace. Geobasic Empire.